Hi, welcome to Lazada University, hub for e-commerce education. In this video, we will show you how to process an order in Seller Center. First, log in to your Seller Center account using your registered email address and password. Then, press Submit. Lazada makes it easy for you to keep track of orders in your Seller Center account. Expect to receive an email notice for every customer's order number from your shop. However, we strongly recommend that you check regularly your shop's orders in Seller Center, ideally first thing in the morning and then for every succeeding two hours. Remember, if your product is out of stock or wrongly priced or cannot be fulfilled for any reason within Lazada's standard lead time, the order must be cancelled. Also bear in mind that it is not possible to get in touch with customers and offer them other products or solutions. That's why you should always keep your stocks up to date. In this way, you will avoid cancellations and make your customers happy. Order processing starts with documents preparation. Please make sure to print the shipping label to insert inside the envelope sleeve to be attached on the packaging. For a quick guide on how to properly pack orders, please check out Lazada University. After packing the order, please proceed to do the following. 1. Please make sure to print the shipping label. Stick outside the package. 2. Include an invoice. Place the invoice or the customer's receipt with the item inside the package. 3. Once you finish printing all documents required and packing the parcel, please make sure to change the order status from pending to ready to ship. 4. In preparation for the pickup, make sure to print two copies of the carrier manifest for all packages that are for pickup. Make sure that the carrier manifest contains the number of packages to be picked up, as well as the total number of items. In Seller Center, all your new orders will appear in the Orders Overview tab and will be visible in the Pending tab. To view, go to Orders, Manage Orders. If you want to see more details, you can click the plus sign on each order to see the following. 1. Complete order contents or order items. 2. Customer information. 3. Seller SKU. 4. Product image. Next is to print first the shipping label for picking of ordered item. Simply tick the box shape on the left side of the screen to select the order for shipping label printing. Next is go to Print tab, above then select Print Shipping Label for selected items. Shipping label contains payment method, customer information, and seller information. Print two copies of the shipping label. Both copies should be placed inside the envelope sleeve in plastic pouch or box. Shipping label should be placed on top of the package or the widest area available, with all barcodes clearly visible. Print on A5 paper or half of an A4. Print two copies of the shipping label AWB. Printer settings Paper A5 Margin Default Orientation Portrait Lastly, kindly ensure that the printing quality is good so that the barcodes can be easily scanned. To validate the order, go back to your pending orders then click Ready to Ship. Make sure to validate within 24 hours to prevent order cancellation. Make sure that orders are picked, packed, and ready to be picked up. Reminder, kindly follow the first in, first out method when fulfilling the orders. Type in the invoice number. Next, click on Save Invoice ID. Confirmation that the invoice ID has been saved will be prompt. Just make a quick review of the details shown, then click Ready to Ship. Click Close on the next pop-up that will appear on your screen. You're now done validating your order. You may anticipate your pickup on the following day. Our pickup team will go to your warehouse location and collect the packages. 
make sure to have two copies of the Carrier Manifest prepared. For sellers who need pickup service, please reach out to our PSC or Partner Support Center. If you are availing of the pickup service, you must print out the Carrier Manifest. To do this, 1. Go to Ready to Ship tab. 2. Click on the checkboxes of the respective orders. 3. Select Print. 4. Print two copies of the Carrier Manifest for the selected item. 5. Give one copy to the courier and keep the other for your record. Both the driver and the merchant should sign in all pages of the manifest. The number of packages picked up should match the number of packages indicated in the carrier manifest. Once the 3PL confirms that the products have been picked up, Lazada will update the order status from ready to ship to shipped. Remember, you can always track your order by entering order number on order's overview page. Once the customer receives the product, the order status will change to Delivered. Take note that only orders with delivered status are qualified for payment. Here are more helpful tips in managing your orders. Remember, the Manage Orders page shows you only the pending orders by default. But you can also view your orders with other filters such as shipped orders. Alternatively, you can export a list of all your orders in CSV format by clicking Export button in the Orders Overview page. Please remember to ship your package orders as soon as possible. If an order is not shipped within Lazada's required lead time, it will be cancelled. Do not consolidate two orders in one shipment. For large or numerous products that cannot fit inside one box, you will need to click on the plus sign on order overview page. Please take note that each of the products has its own ready to ship button. Make sure that you click on all of them and to print out all the necessary documents mentioned earlier. Take note that any cancellation or late shipment will be charged a default fee. If in doubt, you may refer to the packaging guidelines available in the Lazada Seller Agreement. How fast you do order fulfillment according to Lazada standards is one of the key drivers to a happy and fulfilling customer experience. Follow these tips to become a successful Lazada merchant and partner today. Thank you for watching this video and happy selling!